Oh. These are some pretty nice blind ones. <laughs> In 2018, there were 254 accidents that involved kayaking, and around 50% of those accidents resulted in death. You're probably thinking, well, hey, 50% over the span of a year, like, that's, that's pretty good, right? Wrong. Because when you think about it, how many people do you even know that go kayaking? <laughs> probably zero. Oh, f it's a waterfall! <laughs> Kayak Mirage is a hyper-realistic VR game designed specifically to give you that magical kayaking experience that you've always dreamed of, but without any of the risk of death. This is by far the most realistic VR game that I have ever seen, and I wasn't even playing it at max graphics settings. Anywho, enough of me talking, please enjoy the video. Kayak VR Mirage is now tied with Half-Life Alex at the top of my list when it comes to VR games that have graphics of such an extremely high fidelity. I genuinely forgot that I was just playing a video game. I'm just going to be straight up with you guys. If you're watching this video because you are wondering whether or not you should buy this game, the quick answer is yes. Do it! You should definitely buy this game, but don't expect to be getting a crazy kayaking storyline to play through. This game is purely a showcase of the cutting edge hyper realistic graphics that can currently be achieved in VR. You basically just kayak the entire time, and to be honest, it was the most relaxing thing I've done in months. A saw, little dudes. With saw, dude. <laughs> you guys are so short. Look at the way that they waddle, dude. Look at their waddling. Holy sh, buddy. You waddle so hard. <laughs> You know what they call penguins, right? Chicken of the sea. I love these little crab dudes. Oh my gosh, look at these little crab guys. <laughs> Come here. Hey, get over here. I got some butter I need I need help using. Come here, little guys. Come on. <laughs> get, in, get in my belly. Fun fact. Holy shit. Fun fact, guys, I'm allergic to sushi, bro. I can't eat like any type of fish. Fish literally makes me sh myself. Projectile vomit and then pass out. In that order. I failed to mention something earlier. Although, yes, basically the only thing that you can do in this game is kayak. You can also use that kayak to compete in head-to-head -head races with other players from around the world. Racing against other people in this game is a serious shoulder workout. Not only that, the developers of this game actually recommend that you attach your controllers to a stick or a mount so that you can simulate the feeling of a kayak paddle, ultimately increasing your total levels of fear. <laughs> I did this while I was roaming around each location in the game, and although my shoulders were on fire, it definitely made the experience feel that much more real. I'd highly recommend you try that out if you decide to buy this game. The music's pretty wet. Pun intended. Is it weird to want to eat a pained one? Yes. <laughs> that's what I like to call a glacier. Holy sh**. Oh f that's a thick glacier. Dude, I could paddle this thing with my cup. Did you guys know that roughly 420,000 penguins a year die from kayaking accidents? What? True story. Look it up. <laughs> I wonder if they have polar bears in this. That would be hype. Where the polar bears at, huh? I'm trying to find me a goddamn polar bear. Oh, wow. I want to eat them. Kind of. That's how real they look. I want to eat these little f***ing things. Surprisingly, there is a lot more to this game than simply kayaking. There is also a large variety of animated wildlife, like whales. <gasps> it's a mom and a baby. Well, this is nice. Killer whales, penguins, sharks, <gasps> some birds. Oh, good. Dolphins, crabs, stingray. Oh, there's a little fishy. And a dog. Coupled with amazing water physics, visual effects like splashing, leaves falling from trees. Bro, they have like, they have little leaves falling off the trees. Oh, fall into my mouth. Icebergs crashing into the ocean, trash floating in the water, lightning strikes, water ripples when you paddle. I could just, I could literally just chill here and do this all day. Not even shitting you. <laughs> yeah, it's rewind time. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Plant life that you can interact with. <laughs> you can mess with the leaves and shit and the plants, bro. Come on, get out of here. Oh, yes. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> How neat is that? And you did a game that feels truly realistic. To top that off, the sound effects for this game are amazing. What the f is that? Is that a goddamn shark? Surprise, motherfucker. Bro, it's a couple sharks. Ho, oh, oh. ho. Oh, f*** this. Are you boys seeing this? I'm about to get murdered. <laughs> if this was real life, I would be pissing myself. Can I f*** with these sharks at all? Hey, pussy boy, huh? What's down there? Oh, dude, I can actually look at them. Wow, wow. Ugh. Dude, these are some thicky poo sharks. Is this trash? Is this f***? trash in my oceans huh oh you gotta be shitting me what is going on around here son of a mother ass ass Kerchu. I can't believe that there's all this trash in the ocean, dude. Kayak VR Mirage also has some plans for implementing future content. This might be dependent on how well the game sells, but for now, there is a Kayak VR roadmap that players can access online and give suggestions for possible future content. Some of those ideas include real-time multiplayer, so you can kayak and chill with your friends, fishing, trash collecting, new environments, and even an open world mode. Personally, I am excited about the idea of real real-time multiplayer to hang out with your buddies. To take that one step further, I think it would be amazing to see a character creation mechanic implemented into the game that is on par in terms of realism with the Epic Games metahuman creator. It would put Kayak VR Mirage on a whole nother level if you could create a character model that looks exactly like you. So when you are kayaking with your friends, there is an added dimension of realism because it feels like you are genuinely seeing each other while you hang out. Dude, imagine if literally the reality that we're in right now it's just like on someone's computer they're just running a little simulation on our on our little reality that they created and we could just be sitting in that computer some little program some game and that's what our reality is that'd be f crazy <laughs> i'm gonna hit something in my room bro i'm literally sitting in a chair i'll still find a way to punch something in my room just you wait oh <laughs> right in the f mouth then nice real quick i didn't mention this before but not only are the graphics for this game hyper realistic you get an absolutely massive amount of options when it comes to graphic settings i attempted to test how realistic things could look in kayak vr mirage but my pc tapped out once i upped the pixel density setting to about 1.8 and had pretty much every other setting absolutely maxed out for a brief second before my game crashed i saw the clearest and most realistic VR environment I have ever laid my eyes on. I loved every second of playing this game. It honestly felt like a relaxing vacation. I'd have to give Kayak VR Mirage a 10 out of 10. I don't even care that there isn't a ton of content yet. The graphics have stolen my heart. Real quick, I just want to take a second to thank all of you guys for supporting this YouTube channel. Making these videos every week has been some of the most fun that I've had in years. And thanks to all of you who watch my videos and subscribe to the channel, we have finally hit a massive milestone of getting 1,000 subscribers. And I know damn well that this would not have been possible without you guys. Everyone who comments on the videos, everyone who likes the videos, I appreciate you way more than you know. And hopefully it means I won't be getting harassed by any video game characters ever again. <laughs> Well, this is the end of the video, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. Have an amazing weekend. Be safe if you happen to go kayaking. Try not to litter. Don't eat penguins. And I will see you guys next week where I will be doing something. Anywho, bye.